Hi, it's Greg Harrell here with another Vim screencast. And uh, tonight I want to talk about editing cron tab entries. Now, um, as you may know, you can see if you've got a cron tab set up for your user by running this cron tab command with a dash L switch. Um, just say I wanted to turn off this cron job and comment it out. So I'm going to run cron tab again, but with dash E. It's going to fire up Vim. And I'm going to comment the line out. I'm going to save the file, but it didn't work. Um, now, why didn't it work? Uh, well, as you can see there, the error message says that the file must be edited in place. It doesn't like when the file is switched out. And what Vim is actually trying to do when I save that crontab file is something like move it out the way and then write a new file in its place. Um, so the solution is to stop Vim from doing that. Um, the setting that we need to modify is this backup copy one. I mean, as it says here, um, we can basically has set it to yes to have it make a copy of the file and then overwrite the original one. Or we can set it to no um, to make it rename the file and write a new one. Um, but the default is auto. So if I do set or even better set verbose set backup copy, we'll see the current value and also where it got set. So the current value is auto um, and it doesn't mention any file, which tells us this is just therefore the, the, the default on this system. So auto is not good for us. Uh, what we actually want it to be on Mac OS and potentially other OSs as well to make this work is yes. Um, so I'm gonna show you how I do that. Uh, let's go to FT cron, there we go. Um, so you can see I actually have this set up normally and I had commented it out for the purposes of doing that demo. Uh, because this is an FT plugin, basically any time we edit a file of type cron tab, we're going to make a local setting that only applies to this buffer, and we're going to set it to yes. So by the power of logic, this tells you that when the default is backup copy auto, Vim is deciding that it should behave as though you'd said backup copy no, at least on macOS. Uh, so let's try this. Uh, I'm going to try editing that file again. Um, comment out the line. Will it work? Yes, it blends. Um, and likewise, I can go and uncomment it. Oops. Uh, and write it back and you'll see that the write actually worked. Um, so that's just a little tip. If you see the error message, you know you gotta get in there and set backup copy to another value. Uh, I've got some more stuff to record, so I'm gonna go off and do that. Um, if you wanna be notified when it comes out, just subscribe.